Masking Autism. Masking happens when the autistic person is camouflaging their artistic traits or acting in an unnatural way to appear more neurotypical. Why would someone mask their autism? People fear things that are different and can be unkind to others who are different. Many autistics report masking as a way to shield themselves from bullying and ridicule. Males are four times more likely to get an ASD diagnosis than females. Masking is reported way more frequently in autistic females. There has been some discussion if ASD is really more prevalent in boys or if girls are just masking and are being underdiagnosed. Many female autistics report only discovering their diagnosis when their own children were struggling. They simply believed that they were different and needed to pretend to be normal. Autistics who mask have said that it has helped them get friends and jobs. Unfortunately, masking autism has many negative downsides. Some outcomes of masking autism, depression and anxiety, skill regression, and late diagnosis. Early diagnosis and intervention is key to creating long-term positive outcomes. Autism acceptance is a path to not needing to mask. We have to embrace neurodiversity and create acceptance and equity in the same way we do for other differences. Some behaviors have to be targeted because they're dangerous. However, most autistic behaviors don't need to be addressed. Let's connect to talk about your child's needs online at www.sidebysidetherapy.ca, by email at info at sidebysidetherapy.ca, or by phone at 1-877-797-0437. Side by Side Therapy, empowering parents to empower their children.